Hi everyone, thank you for joining me and I want to welcome also the students who will watch the recordings later on. I am Martina, I am part of the international office team at uh, Università Cattolica in Milan and I want to introduce you, you a little bit what um, our programs are at Cattolica. Well, first of all, um, I think that one question that a student has to ask himself uh, when deciding to study abroad is why to choose the place where, where we'll study in and why uh, in, in our case to choose Catholica. So the first question, for the first question here, I have just uh, summarized some aspects that make Italy uh, famous all over the world. So food and wine, our cultural heritage, and in particular, the made in Italy, that is a brand uh, itself. Um, when it is important to scratch the surface and to say that um, they are not only characteristics that are very important for us in Italy, but it's also important to understand why they are so, um, so interesting for us. Uh, it's not just talking about how we eat and drink well, but it's important to know, for example, that Italy is one of the most important wine producers in all over the world, or uh, that there is really um, a very important heritage about food and about the traditions. You will also discover, uh, you will also have the possibility to discover our cultural heritage. Italy is one of the um, of the most important places where there are uh, there is a large number of places declared um, heritage uh, by the UNESCO, and you will have the opportunity to discover all our monuments, uh, landscapes, uh, and our precious cities. In particular, for example, Milan and Rome, that are one of the that are two of the uh, cities where actually we have. Well, um, two of our main campuses. In fact, um, as you can see from this slide, we have five campuses in particular, uh, the biggest one that uh, is in Milan, the, the main one, and uh, there are two others uh, in Cremona and Piacenza that are in particular uh, dedicated to the agricultural faculty, another one in Brescia, and the uh, southern one in Rome, in the capital city, uh, in particular famous for its medicine and surgery faculty. I want to talk to you about the city of Milan that is the main um, the main city where we have our biggest campus. It's a modern and progressive city where you may find uh, it easier to discover how uh, really Italy is a mix up of ancient and modern. And actually Milan has been ranked among the best Italian cities where to study in. So um, it's really important to, uh, to be aware of it once studying uh, in, in Italy. And in particular, I also want to underline the fact that every campus we have, every campus we have paid up is um, particularly dedicated to um, to some aspects that uh, underline uh, the the aspects that I was talking to you about before. So, uh, in particular, the city of Milan um, is uh, the well, let's say it's the main city for fashion, for business uh, and economics. Uh, so uh, here, the main faculty is for example, business and economics management, for example. Then we have the Piacenza and Cremona campus. Uh, um, actually, they deal with food, economics, uh, wine, uh, and uh, so they are particularly related to uh, the, the aspect of food and wine. And also, uh, we have also, yeah, as I was mentioning before, the campus in Rome uh, especially dedicated to uh, medicine and surgery. The second question I was talking to you about is why to choose Catolica? Uh, our university is a renowned international private institution, the biggest one in Italy, and has a broad portfolio of international programs. Uh, in fact, we have more than 30 um, programs taught in English, in, uh, totally in English, and 
we have also um, a diverse international community, thanks to our uh, partnerships all over the world. We have actually um, over uh, 600 partnerships uh, uh, with institutions from Australia and to, um, to Canada, and um, we are um, able to welcome, and we are very happy and pleased to do it, every semester more or less between 400 500 international students we are also supported by our um, erasmus student network that's an organization that organizes events and activities for international students in order to create and grow up our um, diverse international community last but not least i want to underline the fact that we are an entire team of offering tailored services for our international students. I am, uh, I will be your first contact. And I actually was a student at Catolica. So uh, it's particularly important to say it for me because I uh, really enjoyed uh, and joined the possibility to uh, study uh, as you will be studying uh, with us. And so you can also have the point of view of a student who really lived in uh in catolica and also from uh from one who is actually working as international office team and then we have five other people working for you and supporting you from the very beginning so as you're still prospect students until the very end of your stay uh here just a slide to sum up some uh, important facts uh, some important facts and numbers that it was mentioned also before. We have more than 30 English dot programs also uh, for people who, uh, for students who know Italian a little bit, we have more than 200 programs uh, only taught in English, uh, in Italian, sorry. And um, very important is the fact that we have 12 schools, so 12 faculties and all the international students are able to choose um courses from all different faculties so it's uh, an aspect that uh, must be underlined because it's an opportunity you have that's very important so um, you may be um students from uh, the, i don't know the faculty of psychology but you will be able to take courses also from the faculty of um of economics for example um Going in deeply into our academic offer, I want to underline the fact that students will be able to choose between courses uh, from the international and the academic curriculum. The international curriculum uh, is totally designed for international students. Uh, it's totally taught in English and you will find over 40 courses uh, offered every semester. So in the fall, first semester and in the spring, second semester in different areas, as you can see from this slide. They will be courses uh, with an Anglo-Saxon structure, so there will be lectures, of course, but also uh, a practical part with project groups, um, practical activities uh, between mates, uh, and also uh, sites visits or conferences held by um, professional um, workers. So it will be uh, very interesting for you to be part of this uh, um, short classes and uh, another important aspect I, th I think is that there will be midterms and final exams and uh, um, yeah that yeah um, in particular attendance is mandatory so you will be asked to be uh, present uh, in every in every lesson during every lesson but just because uh, you will gain six ECTS uh, that would be uh, very important for you to validate it uh, them to into for your university. Instead, the university academic curriculum offer courses for an undergraduate and graduate level taught in English or in Italian. So international students may have the possibility, of course, if they know Italian, to choose courses also from the um, regular Catholica catalog. Of course, uh, all these courses are divided into the 12 faculties I was mentioning before. We have an, an humanitarian area with uh, the Faculty of Languages, of Psychology, 
uh, of education also and uh, um, other faculties that was mentioning before economics, for example, international relations, political sciences, and so on. Here, I have prepared some slides that um, gave you an, an overview of what our uh, other programs is uh, apart from the academic choice between international and academic curriculum uh, uh, we offer. So uh, in particular and very important is the Italian language course. We offer the possibility to take one or two Italian language courses. We have an intensive pre-session course that begins before classes start and uh, a semester course that instead will be, um, will be scheduled during the, the entire semester. Um, each course gives you uh, six credits, so it would be also helpful to gain um, extra credits and uh, will give you, of course, the possibility in case you don't know Italian to uh, learn another language and the language actually uh, where uh, you're studying in, of, the, of the country you're stud studying in. And, uh, or uh, in case you have uh, just, yes, uh, already a knowledge of uh, our language to improve your language skills. All levels are offered from the very beginners until the upper intermediate. And uh, at the beginning of, uh, the classes we will uh, you will have to take an online test uh, in order to create the different classes depending on the results and on the different levels of the students. Another opportunity we offer to our students it's called the language assistant program. It's actually uh, a volunteering program uh, for students who uh, wish to um, to learn how uh, the high school uh, in Italy works and they actually uh, are asked to be a support for our high school language teachers uh, and will also have the opportunity to learn some uh, teaching skills if they are interested, for example, in educating uh, students uh, at high school. And I think uh, also because I've lived it once uh, uh, when I was an Erasmus student three years ago, um, I think that the opportunity to study abroad and these experience is actually, if well elaborating it, if well lived, actually, it's one of the most important thing to, um, to be marketable for um, when asking, for, when being, being a candidate for a job. And actually, this study abroad impact club is a course we offer that gives you the possibility to value your study abroad experience to make it more marketable, as I was mentioning before, to develop your competencies, to acquire professional skills, also because you will be able to uh, actually study abroad, to study in a different country, to study in a different um, situations also, uh, respect to the um, to the one you're living here uh, you're living at your home institution it will be a 25 content hours course uh, without credit bearing but i think uh, actually that it is a great opportunity for you uh, to uh, begin to enter in the job world another important offer we have is the internship abroad uh, here we offer two types of internships. Uh, the first one is a part-time internship that works uh, um, and runs uh, through the semester. So you will be able to attend two or three courses. We usually suggest this number at Catolica and to complement your semester uh, with uh, uh, this uh, job opportunity, or you will have the uh, opportunity to have a full-time internship after the semester. Um, we usually, um, and in particular, uh, suggest to have this option of the full-time internship after the first semester that goes from more or less September, October until December, February. Um, this is because uh, actually during summer, um, most of the companies shut down because of summer holidays, so it won't be so easy to find a place for you to, uh, to get this, this internship. But the aspect that I want to underline in particular is that uh, uh, this job opportunity is totally designed for students and uh, around their interests 
because um, you will have uh, um, an interview with us uh, in order to understand what are your uh, interests and necessities. And we will bid up for you the project entirely so that we can find the best solution for you, the best uh, company where to start your, um, your internship. Apart from the semester short, uh, program, we have um, summer and winter uh, short-term programs. Uh, in particular, we, we have prepared some courses uh, taken from the international curriculum, so English dot courses uh, at an undergraduate level uh, in very different areas, as you can see here in the slide. Um, that will last uh, to maximum three weeks during summer, so between June and July here at Catolica. And uh, actually, it is a very important um, occasion you will have to uh, gain some credits uh, to have this um, practical experience with us, uh, because as international curriculum courses, all these courses will be uh, will have the, the theoretical part with lectures, but also the practical with project groups, sites facing and professionals with a strong network in the field. So here you can see an example of what the calendar will look like for uh, our uh, upcoming summer program. So uh, from the 13th of June until the 18th, uh, the 22nd of July, you will have the opportunity to um, to find these courses available for you. In particular, I want to underline the fact that you can choose more than one course, of course, but just in an horizontal way. So for example, you can choose for the first week of June, strategic, uh, strategic management and, enter, and entrepreneurship. And for the third uh, week, business government and the global economy. Um, I want to underline this fact just because uh, these are intensive courses, as you can see, they will be, they will run uh, between two, maximum three weeks. So also classes will be, um, uh, if you choose, let's say, if you choose courses in the same period, uh, in the same weeks, uh, uh, you may have difficulties in attending both of them because, because classes will overlap. But of course, you are totally welcome to choose more than one course in an horizontal way. The same works for uh, the winter, uh, the winter short term. In this case, uh, I'm sorry, I don't have an updated uh, calendar because it, this was from last year and we had to reduce uh, the, um, the offer because of, uh, uh, of COVID and some restrictions we had. But in general, you may find uh, uh, most of the courses as you have seen in the summer program. And uh, yeah, uh, also here the same, and I, was, uh, and I want also to underline the fact, uh, returning back to the first slide, that you can uh, see that uh, we offer these courses in all the different campuses we have. So in Milan, or also in Rome, in Piacenza too. So you will be able to jump from, uh, from one campus to another. Regarding accommodation, you will be helped from uh, by us. We will uh, we will provide you with information about where to find a house, where to find an accommodation. Uh, as I was mentioning before, the ESN, the Erasmus Student Network, uh, will help you, uh, giving you some other um, suggestions in order to find the best solution for you. And yeah, just to conclude. Uh, I want to, again, repeat the fact that you will be totally supported and guided by us. Uh, at the beginning of every semester, we organize an orientation event with a welcome address, with icebreaking activities. Uh, unfortunately, this year, we, are, we will restart with um, in-person activities. So you will be able, for example, to uh, have a lunch with us and an aperitivo, the usual typical Italian aperitivo. Uh, here, the, uh, the Italian oral interview I was mentioning before for the, uh, for the students who wish to enroll in the Italian language courses, we will organize a, uh, campus tours and uh, uh, another occasion you will have to meet 
people uh, to meet Italian students too is the buddy program we have organized. So we are uh, we collaborate with Erasmus Student Network students and with buddies that have lived your same experience, so a study abroad experience, and then decided to support students uh, who arrive at Catolica. Of course, our info sessions will be held before the beginning of the semester in order to give you uh, the occasion to uh, better organize uh, the start of your semester. And of course, also of your short term program in case you will decide for a summer or winter, or winter program. Uh, we always remain available for you per email or at, at the office. You uh, can have the possibility to meet us and to uh, well, ask us everything. Actually, uh, there are five people that will work for you entirely. And I think that whenever you will go, uh, whenever you decide to study abroad, it's, uh, this is the best experience you may have in your life. And I, I say, actually, it's because I was uh, an Erasmus student, so I really lived this experience. And uh, it really enriched me because uh, um, you have an intercultural um, landscape all over you and you uh, find out how to <laughs> survive, let's say, uh, in a different country, how to learn in a different country also because, um, yeah, for example, classes or exams are really different. So you will, uh, you will have the possibility to understand how really another country works but uh, it's the best decision you can take in your life. And just to conclude, here I leave you just a slide with our contacts. Uh, I will be the first contact, so if you write to international.inquirysa at unicat.it, I will be the one responding. And you can also, uh, well, um, search in our website, of course, but uh, feel free, free, totally free, to contact us for any of your questions and also curiosities. Thank you, Martina, for the presentation. I think it will be very helpful for our future students that are intend to go to, to Soccer Party. Um, thank you, that was very, very clarifying. So I have more information to, to present them now. Okay, thank you very much. It was a pleasure actually. And really feel free to contact me also with your students. And thank you very much. Thank you, Martina. Your presentation is very good for students. Yes, because it's very clear and easy, easy to understand. Yeah, it's very good. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs>